Double drag it. It's your boy, hey man. It's your boy, like it. We back with some new heat for y'all today. Like I never left. She said. Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Happy holidays. To everybody, hope y'all enjoyed the holidays. What type of presents? What was y'all favorite present y'all got? And tell us about a favorite moment that happened this Christmas. Did some of y'all get married? Did some of y'all, True. you know, get that new that gift that y'all been wanting for? You know, you know? did somebody get cold? You know, you know what I'm saying. Did somebody get a particular, you know, Double Dragon merch for Christmas? Possibly. But yeah, you know what I'm saying? Hope y'all enjoyed it. Man, you know what I'm saying? So we got the villain saga. Yes. Is this considered the season finale? Yeah. It's it's crazy. Episode. 24 episodes, 24 man. 24 episodes in, man. Villain so saga. like 38 weeks. <laughs> For the for the delays, for all the delays. But those those is all understandable because every time it came out, it was still some heat. Facts, man. You know reflecting, Ugh, what's about to happen next? Yeah, so we seen freaking um Thorfinn get bodied by Askeladd. Yeah, learned a lot. Askeladd told his story with his mom and stuff like that, and his dad having to kill his having to kill his dad. And then the thinking game with the king targeting mm-hmm. uh, his homeland, Wales, Askeladd's homeland. King ain't no chump. You know what I'm saying? He actually yep. got some, you know what I'm saying? He got some chess moves out there. Facts. Then we had that, that like, touchy moment with uh, Leaf and uh, Thorfinn. Thorfinn. It you? was, to me, it was done beautifully, man. It was done beautifully, man. <laughs> that was the animation. Dope, man. They give Thorfinn's a whole nother purpose, man. He can finally not be caged and do what, you know what I'm saying, his father would have wanted him to do. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Then they had, um, what was that about? Oh, yeah. Do you Mark think, Dillon. you think uh, Thorfinn going to. Find out no Thorco gonna find out about the truth about happening to Thor's this seat this episode. No. I'm starting to like not put it as a big How information thing now because it's like they keep Why well, touch on the last episode then? They've See been they, they they they've been touching on it little by little. Right, but why do that? I think it's gonna happen this episode. I'm gonna say it happens this episode because like I don't see them like Sprinkling in it, like sprinkling in there, and then let it roll off to the next season. Even if it happens, I don't feel like Thorko is going to like enrage and kill Askeladd or something. I, I'm not saying he's going to do that, but I'm saying that's going to like kind of like affect him in some way. Like it's mm. not going to be no small, like, yeah. dang, that's what happened. Okay. Like that's going to like, because like that's one of the people that he cares the most about in this world, bro. Like, keep. Bro, that's like that's like that's like kind of like his brother. But then Oscar is just gonna tell him that Floki was the one that ordered it, and then true. And then he could tell him that, but like he he definitely gonna like. I I feel like it's it's not gonna happen like right after that. Like right, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like oh, you know what I'm saying? Floki did it. Right now, probably while he laying down, Oscar when uh. Dork would land over him with a freaking freaking sledgehammer or something. He'd probably tell him, you know what I'm saying, to get lucky again. Do you think anybody is dying this episode? This episode? Yeah. No. As much as I want. We got Canoe. We got Canoe not dying, bro. Canoe, Oscar, we got Thorfinn. Do you think Canoe is in that list? To think that he I'm just naming all the main people. Oh, no. Then we got Thorko. Man, it's kind of hard to kill any of them. If anybody's going to die. It has to be Askeladd, probably. It'll, it'll probably be Askeladd. Or, or I'll Actually, probably no. say Thorko is like... It's either those two. I don't see them killing Canute. I don't see... They definitely can't kill Thorfinn, of Can't kill Thorfinn. Leaf kill is him. possible. Leaf is possible to die. But what for what reason? Because it could, be, it could just be like some type of like... Some rarity. It's just something happened. And then it's like Thorfinn's like... Like chance to like get away. Was like... It doesn't completely get diminished, but like that was kind of something dies, that helped him. His job was done already. Yeah, yeah, for like putting that putting that different option in his in, head, in of his course. Head. But yeah. um, but yeah, he he definitely him, Thorkel or Askeladd. I don't think Askeladd is dying seen. because I feel like Thorfinn is going to get another chance to fight him at a better state. So mm-hmm. I don't think he's gonna die. Askeladd's gonna die in this episode. Okay. 
Um, I'm just saying there was there was just three possible people. Oh yeah, yeah. And, and then, then we got the um the traitor, the traitor dude. Oh yeah, right. He's gonna die this episode. If he dies, it's just like, man, like somebody gotta die this episode. Right. You think you think nobody got you think nobody gonna die in a in a in like a Viking type of anime? Is I'm saying I know that somebody can die, but when we look at the story and the reason is, it's just like don't expect nobody to yeah, die. Yeah, I don't expect nobody to die. I'm gonna say somebody dies. Season finale. Somebody always die. Who you think gonna die? Oh man, my number the king? one choice. You think they gonna finally get cho- the king? If that's the only person I'll say. Or oh, Floki. It just seems too easy. I don't know to, why they talk to, to Floki. Floki's possible, but if I was doing like one of the main mains, I'm gonna probably say Leaf. Leaf. Leaf gonna die. If I don't want him to die though, right. I don't want Leaf to die though. If Thorku finds out the information. About what really happened to Thor's, then I mm-hmm. think Thor, I think Floki dying this episode. Floki dying, yeah. We'll see, man. I'm ready to get to it. It's the last episode, so I'm gonna savor this. You know what I'm saying? See what happens. All right, ready to run it up? Yeah. Reconsider. Oh yeah, Asgard stepped up to him. He told him to come up. Oh yeah, yeah. Objective things playing. Is he ordering him to go do the hit? He said, I ain't backing down. Look at Canoe. Wait, what did he offer him? He probably told him to go um, go destroy Wills. He trying to finesse. <laughs> good luck, thank you. Dang, you can't turn that down, King. Changing the people's mindset on it. He's good at talking. <laughs> <laughs> he said he's going to kill him. He got. <laughs> I wouldn't get that close to Astrolog, bro. He had no choice but to do this. <laughs> he wanted something to go. He didn't even care, bro. He's like, I'll get you another way. Right. The whisper? <laughs> oh, shoot. You serious? They did this background check. Bro, oh my gosh. Can't even know. Dang, he Is he gonna leave? Both are not leaving right now, right? Dang. Okay. Oh, they ain't leaving right away? Mm-mm-mm. What is this pigeon symbolizing? He about to fly free? Be free? Mm. Maybe finally realizing nothing but hatred for the first time in his freaking life? You just let some food go away. Shit. No, God dang it, bird. You ain't gonna do leave so suddenly. Keep, keep your eye on him, man. He told him to choose, G. In front of everybody? They hate the way your face looks. This man is a G. <laughs> he like, did he just like, do that? Yeah, a freak. Oh, it's war. And I ain't no turning back now. Killers ain't his Oscar lot. <laughs> he looked at Canute. <laughs> he ain't acting normal. How can you forgive him? I'm trying to, I'm trying to. Askeladd finally giving in to the emotion. Askeladd My nickname, Covered in Ash. That means he about to kill him, G. Altorius Costas. Over the land of New Year. Wait, Canoe can save him, I think, though. Because he, cause he, he did now. Save Askeladd. Yeah. Said it had to be the king. 
He did that twice in two days. Swipe the blood off his sword. Don't talk about nobody mama, man. I feel better now. Yo, you serious? That just went from zero to a hundred quick. What's the rule? What? No! No! Ask a lot! If Thorfinn's. No! Damn, look at his face. No! Bruh, what is going on? Skalide went mad, bro. Doku ain't doing nothing. Shizn it. Dang! Dang, man. Somebody about to catch him. Hold it in. Doku! <laughs> <laughs> he wanna kill us like this, G. I don't think he went mad. I think he's doing this all calculated. Yeah, he, he ain't going mad. Depending on the act. Both me and Will. Wow. Mmm. Oh my god. He <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can't control him. Mm-hmm. Mm. Do it yourself. Ooh, yeah, you getting this smoke. Freaking kill Floki, bro. I'm right here, live and real. Shouldn't have said that. Man, he put two hands on the sword. Floki finally get what he deserves. No, you think I'm gonna get stabbed in the back? Dang it. It better not be who I think it is, bro. Canute. It better not be Canute, oh, bro. Who stabbed him? Oh he my is gosh! Trash. Look how you looking at him. That wasn't even. That was kind of a shallow cut. What? Were he hit like a vital or something? His heart. Mmm. Dang. Talk. All this talk about dying. Like three people died already. <laughs> Wow, he sacrificed himself. Ask a lot. Ask a lot. Sacrificed himself, Z. Why you let him? Let me rest. Sorry to make you wait. Dang, he even trying to save Canoe, save right, Wells, and give Thorfinn him. Dolphin probably never thought he'd die by anything else. I wouldn't even do it now. Right. Free him, bro. Isn't it? Questions that need to be answered. He fathering him while he's dying, G. You been doing this whole time? Hey. Move forward already. They go to bird. Hey, is he releasing this, man? Askeladd knew what his real fight was the whole time, bro. Ah, he knew what a true warrior was. He knew. Why are you talking to this man right now? <laughs> Thorku knew what was gonna happen, bro. Thorku seen that. You gonna have that scar for a minute. Thank you for sparing us, though. You still alive? <sighs> Come on, Asuka, you could have took one more out. Yes! Thank you. Dorko? Dang. Title change. We got them fast as heck. That was his promise, technically. 
Had to dismiss him. Hey, Canute dodged. I don't know if that was a kill shot from Thorfinn, but he evaded. I think no, Thorkel helped him. I thought he got that slice off first before Thorfinn got there. I think he pushed him back. Finally going I hope him. he don't go from one one vengeance to another. Hey, they better be careful, Thorfinn. <laughs> he been wanting that for so long, bro. Man, he dropped his dead knife. Is this him deciding to become a true warrior right now? He going in with this freaking sword. I mean, his dagger. Dang, bro. Dang, he just let it all go. The freak? Does him and leave? Oh, is that his, uh... Sister Helga? Sister? What the heck is that? Are these, like, season two people? Seems like it. Mm. What the freak is this? He is definitely season two. Yeah. Dang. Boy, season finale, crazy. Yeah, the season ending kind of ended the same way as Dr. Stone in regards to them showing, showing like the future with the characters and stuff like that. Yeah. So, yeah, I, I was like, I don't remember you from little even bit of a scene. I don't remember right. none of them. Like, yeah, that was, that was wild, bro. Freaking uh, Oscar, bro. I knew once, I knew once Thorfinn left the, uh, Thorfinn left the boat from Leaf mm -hmm. that he was finna see something, bro. And yeah. then once that stuff started happening with Askeladd, it was like he was gonna see him die, bro. Yeah, yeah. It's um, it's kind of by him leaving that boat, he made the choice to like not even take the other option, it's just to go back. Cause you know what I'm saying, he left, he left for a reason. Then, but I did not expect like one, I didn't expect Askeladd to just just Kill turn up like that. But yeah. he seemed that king, the king gate, like that was his. Him just thinking real fast. Yeah. And that was the only... He's like, damn, that's the only option. It's the but only option. You can't imprison somebody. I know you killed the king, but you can't imprison him. You know what I'm saying? Like, you the king. You talking about... This, uh, this uh, uh, yeah. Talking about? Okay. He couldn't imprison my man. I'm like, I thought he was going to let him go for a minute and then, like, knock him out or something Think about like this. That. You the king. You just got killed. Like, you think they're going to imprison the person that just killed him? If I'm the king, you have to do what I say. That's I'm why we're saying. not attacking whales. And that, <sighs> because I said we're not attacking it. I can understand if Canute wasn't on Ascalon's side. That's understandable. But he was. That was... Yeah, that was but whole, that whole scene was like... How are you going to be the like, king? They're not going to accept you as a king if you show pity on him. He could have gave him like a less... Like some type of like sneak sneak attack, vital, like non-vital... Stab him and just drag him off. You know what I'm saying? He could have preserved him, bro. He could have preserved him. Bro. He hey. preserved him. But that's what happened. We can't go against what happened. It's messed up. I My feel favorite like character gone. But, yeah. This is crazy. And as much as I wanted Askeladd to die, he died doing like a heroic act. Yeah, not that's, only, that's how I said it was going to happen. Not only did messed up. he protect Wells... But then he protected Canute because the Teen King said choose between Will and Canute. He protected both of them. And he gave Thorfinn freaking uncaged him, bro. He knew the whole time what the true will he was. He asked him what he was going to do after he after he died. Like, he set Thorfinn free. And, like, all three of those things in one just for the Go. sacrifice of his life, bro. Go. You know and what I'm saying? And it's just like, like, then also, we don't even know what would have happened had Thorfinn not run in at that particular time. Cause the second he ran in there, he turned, looked at him, had to tell him to go back. Next thing you know, bam, impaled. Yeah, I feel like I feel like it had to be freaking. Kind of, I still like, makes sense though, but God dang, this one. I still like. I feel like he that like he, that's what he wanted to happen basically. Yeah, I mean, so Thorfinn coming in or not, I feel like he would have like found some way to have Canute kill him so that he could save him, save Canute. <sighs> But that was cold what Thorkel said, like, like the, his own master should be putting down, like, nah, he like, he's not like a yeah, dog. Yeah, you do it. I ain't doing this stuff. Shiznit, bro. Yeah. This was, this was, this was a scene with the dag dagger falling down with the memories and all mm -hmm. of that stuff. That was, that was a beautiful so scene. So, do, do, do you still think that Thorfinn didn't, didn't care about Osquad? What you mean? I mean, like, I feel like he wanted to kill him. Yeah, still wanted to kill him. Yeah. That's it. Didn't care about him at all, like feelings, you know what I'm saying? Like, had some type of feelings towards him. No, I don't think he cared about him. All he wanted to do was... So he thought to... he was crying because he didn't get a chance to kill him. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> right. Hey, yeah, I was smirking my sister. Like, you... Like, I feel like 
Thorfinn, all he said was wake up. I ain't saying nothing else. All all he said was wake up so I can do you, so I can kill you. To me, personally, that's not something that you, if you care about somebody, you don't want to kill them. That's me personally, but yeah, man. Oh man, this was this was this was crazy, bro. This episode was crazy. I wasn't ready for this at all. And then we thought nobody's gonna die. Who thought nobody's gonna die? I guess in the beginning, I said somebody was dying. You said somebody was dying, but like you know, like we didn't know who would die or nothing like that. And then I you said Asgard, Leaf. You said Leaf, oh, and then okay. there was another person I picked. I thought you was naming everybody, and then you said Leaf. I said Leaf was my number one, and then two I had. I had Asgard number two or three, but yeah, he was in the three though. And I didn't think Asgard was gonna die because I felt like Thorfinn would have a chance to fight him at a better state. Mm-hmm. I mean, like that part, I could believe that, but I knew for a fact that Thorfinn was never gonna kill him. Like he was never gonna, he was never gonna get his ones how he wanted it to, because that's just, that's just because they were setting it up to like for it to happen so bad. Yeah. So it was just like it was like the dude with the little fishing rod. Oh, you almost got it. And then like, ink. Got to be quicker than that. Ink it back, bro. Then freaking. Uh, I don't like the fact that canoe did it. That's so lame. But it makes sense. Don't be like, oh, that's supposed to happen. I don't understand that. I just don't like it. It made sense to the fact that now he's the king now, and he had to yeah. like. Now you have a battle that. scar. You have a battle scar. You really go to battle, but uh, I guess Thorku recognized it. Like Thorfinn was hard to predict in that moment when he looked up hard to Asgard, predict when he was uh, before he attacked Canute. Yeah, I'll, I'll, the only person that could like know what was going was for real was, was it was because him. when he looked up like that, I was like, "Is he going to?" I didn't know what he was going to do. I thought he was going to murk him. I was like, "You like like because because I, I think he cares. He cares about Asgard. Like, yeah, he want to kill him, but like you can't ignore like being just fathered for those those years. You know what I'm saying? Being taught this, that, and that. You know what I'm saying? Being taught in a different way. Like he not teaching you like a like a genuine loving father. He just teaches you in a different you know matter. So I felt like he kind of seeing him as his like father but not in that literal sense Thor is gonna always be his father but he saw him as like a like a father figure but he still wanted to kill him because of what he did but you know what I'm saying so that's Thorku, why I say he still uh, care Thorku saw that shit in it bro and, Her, he, and he got it and stopped him he was him, so bro. close too so close that was crazy uh, so now I wonder what's gonna happen going forward is Thorku just gonna like have a new vengeance now and wanna kill Canute um, or is he gonna like finally take leaf advice and just sail away? Personally, I feel like at the end, him dropping a dagger was symbolic of him like becoming a true warrior and like leaving it. So I don't think he's gonna have visions toward Canute after this, mm. um, because like him dropping it and showing. So you think he's gonna grow? Grow now? Yeah. Canute, uh, Thorfinn. I think he's gonna grow now. So I think that was a setup for that. So I'm looking forward to it. They showed some new people at the end. It looked like they was all like traveling toward a certain destination, possibly because they had the people in the water yeah, sailing. The, yeah, it was people different in the snow areas. on the mountain going somewhere. So I feel like it's either gonna be like we're gonna be venturing off to go to um to America, I guess they call it, or Vinland. Vinland, yeah. Or he gonna try to kill Canute because he came in. At a different time than the whole thing went down. All yeah. he seen was people yeah, he jumping at Asgard. What, what was happening? You see what I'm saying? So see, like, he was like, "What was going on?" And then Canute did technically spare him. You know what I'm saying? He did technically spare him. I think once he calmed down and kind of like realized, like I feel like him I don't know, but that's that. kind of what you saying. He killed somebody close to him. But I don't, you know, I don't really feel like he liked Oscar. Like he cared about Oscar like that. They ain't like Thor. Close to him, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I don't, I don't feel like that. But I don't know after all those years of wanting to kill him and not being able to kill him, like that can be it to why he would have vengeance toward Canute, but not because he killed. Asgard. I feel like the whole thing about him killing, killing Asgard was like in his mind he saw it as like that's the main objective because he couldn't see see nothing else. Right. But deep, deep, deep down, he couldn't ignore that he had feelings for him. What y'all yeah. think about the whole Asgard and Dorfin relationship? Put it down below. Yeah, man. But and tell us what about how you feel about season one. So overall, favorite moment of uh Villain Saga. Villain, yeah, favorite moment, favorite character. 
I guess I don't know if we could do white foods. There's not a lot in here. No, this ain't even favorite fight. We could do favorite moment, favorite fight, and favorite, favorite character. character. Favorite character, Thor's. Okay. Um, favorite fight will probably be Thorku versus Thorf in the second fight. Yeah, when uh, Asgard was kind of injured. Yeah, Thor okay. versus Thor in the second fight. And okay. then uh, favorite moment, I well, don't know. The first thing that popped in my head was Canute bossing up. Canute bossing up? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, favorite character, Asgard. Favorite fight. fight. Can a battle count as a fight? Because I'm thinking when they when they, uh, when they they met um, Thorka for the first time, he was on that bridge. Mm-hmm. I mean, Thorfinn did fight him there. Yeah. So if you want to consider that. I guess when, whenever they met, like, Thorka for the first time, he was just doing throwing freaking spears across the freaking, you yeah. know what I'm saying, the whole river, just murdering people. Yeah. I think that was, like, my favorite fight. And then my favorite moment, it got to go to Asgard's uh, last hurrah, bro. Like, to be able to think that quick and to, like, Give your life to to your homeland and to a stranger, but he's not really a stranger. You kind of knew him for a couple, you know what I'm saying, for a minute, but like for like a purpose where you're not going to be able to to like live inside of it, you're able to give your life for that. That's just, hey man, take my hat off to it. Yeah, this is this is crazy, man. I feel like there's a lot of good moments in there. I yeah. really wish like Thor was alive a little longer. I know he lasted like two or three episodes. Mm-hmm. Um, but seeing what he was saying about what a true warrior was and how cold he was, yeah, skill wise and stuff like that, like it just made me want to know like more about him more. And I feel like it's like, I, like I, you know, I'll never get to get to experience that. I feel like they're gonna probably give us more people that connected with Thor, so we could be able to see him in this natural, you know what I'm saying, element, but through the eyes of other people. So we might be able to still see some things about him. Like, you know how people just be like, oh, I know your daddy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So we probably, well, probably see some other things. that's what happened with Thorkel, but we didn't really get a chance to Yeah, like... yeah. They never had no, right like, real time. Only time they always had talking is when they fight, which is kind of weird because they'd be walking together all, you know what I'm saying? You would yeah. think you'd want to talk to him about that, but I don't think that's that's who Dorkel is. Like, he don't seem like that type of just be like yeah. sitting there to reminisce with you. But he said, I mean, they said, bruh, he said, you know, that they fought together yeah. a bunch of times. And in the beginning, they showed them fight together. We didn't know who that Dorkel mm-hmm. dude was in the beginning. But like, to see them yeah, actually in a crazy fight. Either. Yeah, like Dorkel and Thor's together, bruh. Crazy, bruh. Just to see a war with them two on the same team, bruh. Like, that'll be freaking crazy. But, man, I love Vinland, man. Definitely one of my favorite anime of the year. Um, you know, I feel like we should do like a favorite anime of 2019. Be do like a top three, maybe. Top three? Like a video? Do, yeah, video. Okay. Let's see. But um, this was dope, man. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to comment down, um, like I mentioned earlier, and don't forget to like and subscribe. And make sure you check our videos out on Patreon before you put them on YouTube. Thanks, man. We'll see y'all again in the next uh, season, man. Double Dragon out. Peace. Deuces.